This is Jamo and today I bring you the new Blender 4.0 with plugins already installed. So the first thing you're going to do, you're going to drag this folder into your desktop. Now once we have that folder, you're going to open it and you're going to notice you have a Cyberface folder. This folder, you're going to open it and you're going to drop your scene files and your model files here. Now you're going to open it as you do regularly. And if you see a Lakers jersey with normals, it's working properly. Now, if you want to import your model, all you have to do is click import. Another thing that I already set up, so it's way quicker for you, you already have all the materials currently assigned. So over here, how we're going to do it, is first you're going to create a blank material and make it any color and then for your next material now you're going to use from the drop down and then you're going to select the texture you want to edit on this case you want to do your face now you want to assign it so you click your model go into edit mode select only the UV group of the mesh you want to assign the texture to blend head shape and then you go into your materials tab and you, while you're selecting this face texture you're going to assign it now when you go into object mode you can see that's the LeBron face texture that, that I included with the with the add-on now how do you make it so it's your textures instead of mine go into your cider face and make sure you replace these textures with whatever you want to edit and you have to make sure they are named the same right here so this is face.png you need to name your face your face texture face.png as long as you replace this you're going to be editing that now let me let me show you how to assign all the te other textures same thing you're going to go into your edit mode you're going to click your UV group for your torso this time, right? Actually, it's not torso, the base body shape. Go into your materials, you're going to add a, add a material, and then you're going to select from the drop down. Your chest, and then you click assign right here. If you mess up and you assign the face, all you have to do is click on chest while you're highlighting it and assign the right one. Then when you go to object mode, you see LeBron's texture right here. Same thing with the legs and the eyes. Let me show you the eyes real quick though. Select the texture, drop down, assign. Now, if you want to paint your texture, all you have to click is up here in texture paint. And your stencil will already be right here. All set up for you. Let's go here on face. And if you only want to, you should, you should go here into object mode, right? Go into edit and select whatever you want to paint. So right here, you're going to select your face, which is the blend head shape. And now when you click here on texture paint, you click up here and you will only be able to paint what you selected. And this is how people usually texture paint. And if you click, click over here on face, you're going to see that you're going to see the changes over here. So you're going to make all your changes, right? And then you click here on image and you're going to save and that's it. Once you hit save right here, it's going to, all, the, your, all your changes are going to reflect over here. Another thing that I did is 
let's say you want to import facial hair, but you don't know how to assign, let's say, you don't know how to assign the transparent textures, right? You go into your materials, create a new, not create a new one. You create a new one up here, select from the drop down, and you select facial hair. And as you can see, it's a transparent texture. Easy. And that's it. I hope you enjoy, and this makes your 2K modding much easier.